want to show you the signal characteristics of porosity. <clears throat> this plate is 0.625 inches thick and here's the weld right in the middle just a little bit um, upstream of the uh, center line there's cluster porosity in this weld so I want to show you what it, that looks like. I calibrated uh, my Epic 1000 using a 60 degree probe. Um, 60 degree is good for getting into the uh, body of a weld and it's a 4 megahertz signal so I calibrated with my IIW block I set my reference level uh, with the side drilled hole uh, the, the, the 0.6 deep side drilled hole on my IIW I set my reference level to 8% full screen height now I want to show you, porosity is, is a very low amplitude signal, so I am scanning 12 dB hot, which is extremely high. I added 12 dB to my, to my uh, uh, reference level. So scanning on this 60 degree, this signal right here is popping up. This, this is, I'm in a good area of the weld, that's my root signal. It's a nice root signal, and if I pull back, what I see here, that's my toe signal. That would be this guy right there. See, I can finger dampen that. So, scanning back and forth with my 60 degree. Now let's move over into the body of the weld and boom, here we go. In the body of this weld, right in here, we're seeing some porosity right there. There's, there's porosity. Um, let me move over. I'll run parallel to the weld and we'll see it come and go. There's, there's typical porosity. And then boom, see it disappeared? It disappeared and the toe of my weld came up. So my energy, if I slide back over here parallel to the weld, we'll see there's, there's a typical uh, porosity signal. And as you can see, my sound beam is being consumed by that porosity because I'm not seeing the toe of my weld over here. It's blocked out. So look at porosity. It's very low amplitude, very broad based. Um, I've heard people call, uh, say it looks like uh, Homer or uh, uh, Simpson, Bart Simpson's hair. Now as I rotate the probe, we can see each little individual uh, bubbles of porosity. See how how they kind of come and go. There's a there's a cluster of porosity there. Very low amplitude signal. Let me show you. Let me move my gain down to uh, my reference level. Now this reference level. Remember, I set that reference level using the side drilled hole on my IIW block. Let's see how how weak with a low amplitude signal that is. It would be very hard to see. Very hard to see that at, at, at reference level. So running this thing 12 dB hot gives me an opportunity to find it. At least it will jump up on the screen, it will grab your attention, and then you can uh, play with your gain and, and and uh, do analysis on this signal. But there it is, there's proxy. The other thing is, I should see it on both sides of the weld. And there it is. I'm seeing a proxy. Let's look at the good part of the weld. Again, I'm up here, that is the uh, root of my weld. Pull back on the second leg, and uh, I'm getting a good signal right there. That's the far side toe of the weld. So somewhere in between, I'll find this proxy. There it is. It's on the second leg, bouncing off the bottom of the plate, up, and there's our porosity. See, very low amplitude, very broad base signal. Hard to find unless your, your uh, amplitude, uh, your gain is turned up high enough to get a, a good signal. 